Hi everyone, and welcome to Guide Dogs Victoria's very first International Guide Dog Day virtual award presentation. Really a sign of the times in terms of what we're living with right now. And I sincerely hope that you and your loved ones are coping as best you can during this COVID-19 pandemic. In these unprecedented and challenging times, I believe we could have been forgiven for letting International Guide Dog Day pass without notice or fanfare. And I certainly acknowledge that um, there are many people out there who are dealing with tremendous anxiety or even great loss at the moment, who may not feel that there is much to celebrate. That's why I guess I felt it was very important that we do celebrate what we can, when we can, and to allow joyful moments to brighten those otherwise dark days. Moreover, that we also take the opportunity to honour those who ensure that the most vulnerable members of our community are supported in the good times and in times of crisis, just like we're dealing with right now. And on International Guide Dogs Day, what better place to start than with our extraordinary, beautiful guide dogs, whose boundless love, intelligence and companionship contribute to the lives of so many people every day. Of course, our guide dogs wouldn't be the incredible animals that they are without the support of our community and people just like yourselves. Which brings me to our very first award for the year the Independence Award for 2020. And as in previous years, there are two Independence Awards, one for a volunteer to Guide Dogs Victoria and one for one of our valued employees. This is to recognise their outstanding con contribution to Guide Dogs Victoria. And this year, I'm thrilled to announce that the Independence Award for 2020 for our volunteer will go to Val Riseborough. Congratulations, Val. I know what a contribution you make. Such a well-deserved um, award, particularly after almost 25 years as a volunteer across many functions of Guide Dogs Victoria and a valued puppy nurturer from the very beginning of our pup puppy nurturing program. There's absolutely no doubt Val is an integral, integral part of the Guide Dogs Victoria family and the lives of our precious pups and our wonderful clients. Congratulations, Val, and thank you for everything that you do for Guide Dogs Victoria. Our second Independence Award goes to Guide Dogs Victoria Orientation and Mobility Instructor, Jenny Black. Congratulations, Jenny, such a well-deserved award as well. For over 30 years, Jenny has worked with clients of all ages to find the right tools to help them independently and safely navigate their way through their environment and has led the way in developing best practice programs to support clients with low vision or blindness, particularly related to those people with an acquired brain injury. You know, I believe one of Jenny's magnificent clients said it the best of all, attributing a large part of her recovery from an acquired brain injury to Jenny's support and care. This amazing woman now refers to Jenny quite simply as an angel. Congratulations, Jenny. Thank you so much for all that you've done over the 30 years with Guide Dogs Victoria, not only with our clients, but also the contribution that you've made to our wonderful organisation. Next, we have our Freedom Award. And this award is in recognition of providing an outstanding contribution to Guide Dogs Victoria. This year's award is awarded to Richie's Stores. <clears throat> Since their inception of their community benefit program in 1993, the strength of the Richies brand and the generosity of the Richies community has funded the training for 12 of our puppies to become skilled guide dogs. The independence and companionship that these splendid dogs have gone on to provide for 12 of our clients is truly priceless. I'd also like to take the opportunity to wish the team at Richie's a very happy 50th birthday on behalf of all of us here at Guide Dogs Victoria. What a monumental milestone that is. So congratulations, Richie's. Thank you so much for everything that you've done for Guide Dogs Victoria over many, many years, together with the contribution that you make more broadly to the broader community. Thank you, Richie's, for all that you do. 
Our next award recognises those who enhance independent outcomes for people who are blind or living with low vision. The Inspiration Award goes to a wonderful organisation, the Shine On Foundation. Over the past four years, the Foundation has supported numerous Guide Dogs Victoria programs. These include the establishment of our social enterprise Dialogue in the Dark, the Orientation and Mobility Graduate Scholarship Program, many of our children's mobility camps, and most recently, the establishment of Guide Dogs Victoria's Early Childhood Intervention Service, a program that we've been wanting to get off the ground for such a long time, but we really needed to raise the funds to be able to do that. Now, because of the Shine On Foundation, this program will become a reality to support these children and their families. In addition to this, the Shine On team are also very, very proud puppy sponsors, having supported the journeys of five of our splendid dogs. Huge thank you to everybody at the Shine On Foundation. We enjoy a wonderful partnership with you, with you all. We look forward to continuing that partnership and to making a difference in the lives of so many people that you do. And last, but by no means least, the winners of the Community Access Award for 2020, recognising those who go above and beyond in access, inclusion, and customer service for people with low vision or blindness. This year's award goes to the Culture Group. In 2019, after a two year run, our social enterprise Dialogue in the Dark season ended under the guidance of Guide Dogs Victoria. And you know, without hesitation, the Culture Group stepped in and employed most of the Dialogue in the Dark guides all of whom are blind or have low vision, as well as most are valued clients of Guide Dogs Victoria. You know, this is just one example of the Culture Group's generosity of spirit that all stems from the huge heartedness of company directors Nadine Castle and Joanna Gayson. Huge thank you, Nadine, Joe, and the rest of the Culture Group team. Really appreciate everything you've done and particularly that, you, that the Dialogue in the Dark Enterprise continues to deliver, deliver a great service to the community, thanks to your work. That brings us to the end of the 2020 International Guide Dog Day Virtual Awards. I am so very, very proud to call all of our award recipients a part of the Guide Dogs Victoria family, as well as all of you who are tuned in today to help us honour them. Without your ongoing support, we absolutely would not be able to continue to do the work that we do and make the difference in the lives of the thousands of people that we do every year. But as I close off, I'm reminded of the wonderful lessons that we can learn from our beautiful guide dogs. Our guide dogs are taught to be present, in the present, to only focus on the immediate task at hand and to not get distracted. Our guide dogs sense the behaviours, the feelings and the energy of those around them and lean in when comfort is needed. For a dog, every morning is the start of an absolutely wonderful day and every walk, of course, is the very best walk. Every meal, of course, is the very best meal and every interaction with the ones they love is the absolutely best interaction. So I'd ask you all to learn from the, from the behaviours of our beautiful dogs and rejoice at this time in life's simplest moments by taking time to celebrate the many simple gifts that can be found in our daily lives. Even in the darkest of times, I know that we can get through any challenge life can, may deliver. Thank you all again. These are very trying times but I wholeheartedly believe we have the opportunity to gain some valuable insights from the weeks and the months ahead. I'm confident that by banding together, we will all emerge from these uncertain times, stronger, wiser, and ready to take on what I'm absolutely sure will be a very exciting and very rewarding future for all of us. So I would ask you all as I close to stay safe, 
Take care of yourselves and of those around you and know that Guide Dogs Victoria will be here supporting our community every step of the way, just like we have for the last 62 years and we will well into the future. My best wishes to you all. all. Please take care.